My name is Brian. I am a holistic health practitioner in Encinitas, California. I practice basically on uh, injuries for athletes and get them better quickly so they can return to their favorite activity. Well, this journey first began for me uh, nine years ago when I was actually hit by an automobile while riding my bicycle. And um, I had a number of injuries, uh, plenty of broken bones and uh, damaged tissues, tendons, ligaments. You know, systemic inflammation, not sleeping well, uh, a lot of discomfort. So left shoulder, I had two tendon tears, three labral tears. My right elbow uh, had been shattered. It was in eight pieces, my ulna. Um, so I, I did get a, a corrective surgery for that initially. Um, I had uh, broken my wrist and uh, basically my, um, I had uh, had a, a good deal of um, internal damage, including uh, osteoarthritis in many of my joints. Uh, from my activities throughout my life as well as my work. I had uh, lost a great deal of my range of motion and just basically feeling pretty miserable, honestly. So uh, I wanted to find uh, ways that were significantly more natural and healing and with no downside. A client of mine had um, suggested this Joe Rogan um, interview podcast and um, uh, Mel Gibson on there actually. And it was amazing. And uh, from there, I grabbed Dr. Neil Reardon's book. I read it three times. So uh, I was hoping that this would be the ticket to get back to where I was. And I was right. The booking process was very simple. Uh, I just um, got online, filled an application. And when I got the approval, it was amazing. You know, I was uh, thrilled, actually. And so once I, you know, began you know, the process of having some hope again, I was absolutely elated. The staff made me feel right at home. Everyone here is super nice and bilingual too, which is important for me. Well, you know, they care. I mean, that's the very first thing is actually they're interested in me and results. And that's invaluable to me. Hard to find. After my first treatment, my lumbar pain had completely dissipated. Uh, typically lingering lumbar pain throughout the day um, and then uh, my hands, uh, no more arthritic symptoms in my hands. Two months after, uh, probably I had maybe reduced my knee inflammation by 70%. And so I started riding up to par again and was able to, you know, procure some significant wattage again on the bike, which was amazing for me. It had been years. As far as my running goes, uh, no way could I do it before my first treatment. No. Uh, my knees were killing me <laughs> and I had given it up and I love running, you know, and I, I honestly, I was hoping <laughs> that I could run again, but I, I definitely can run again. So that's, that's incredible. The fact that I can even ride again is amazing, but the running is just, you know, icing on the cake. I got to say too, my brain health is definitely better, much more cogent thinking, you know, um, just clarity of thought. That blew me away because honestly, it wasn't what I had come here looking for, but I found that it's got to be the systemic anti-inflammatory effect. So that was pretty cool. So clarity of thought is a big deal <laughs> for me and the ability to communicate you know, with my clients. It's paramount. As far as friends and family go, um, you know, they've noticed changes in me immediately. Uh, I will say especially my clients. So you know, they're asking me, well, you know, what kind of, you know, things have happened? How do you feel better? What, what is better? You know, uh, do you still have the knee issues? Can you run? You know, so I have, uh, you know, quite a contingent of athletes coming into me daily. And, um, you know, they're very curious and they want to know. And I've sent um, seven of them already who have come and uh, they're elated. Uh, July 15th of this year, I did uh, what's called the Death Ride, which is a well-known ride in Northern California on the, on the bicycle. And um, it's called Death Ride for a reason, probably one of the hardest rides that I know of actually <laughs> throughout the U.S. certainly. And um, I did it on the stand-up bike. Um, the Elliptigo is the company that puts it out and uh, it's 35 to 40% harder than a uh, normal bicycle. And I'm the first person actually in history to do it. I think um, when I first came to the Institute and actually even reading Dr. Reardon's book, um, you know, it just radiated hope to me. To have all this function back is, it's everything to me. So movement is life, you know, and when I didn't have it, 
you know, it's very depressing. And so, you know, I was literally elated after the first treatment. I gotta say, I would recommend this 100%.